just want to hear the music, that's all. Is it too complicated to just keep my records in the category, okay? Just put the rock and roll in with the rock and roll. Put the R&B in with the R&B. That's eight children. I mean, you're not going to put Charlie Parker in with the rock and roll, would you? What does it all mean? I don't know. Who is Charlie Parker? Yes! Okay, let's take a look at the print driver. The Office Jet 8500A. Okay, over here we have the Office Jet Pro 8500A910 network. I click on it, I get our Office Jet Tool. That's not what I wanted. Let's do this again. And I'll tell you, I just installed Windows 7 and it didn't take this long to get to a printer with the XP. So let's go this, this way and so do properties. Okay, that shows me really not what I'm looking for. How about pr we're looking for printing preferences right there. Okay, this is what the print driver looks like. Pretty simple. Duplex. Page order. Over here. And it's got two 250 sheet trays so you can specify Here's your standard paper sizes and a crash. Here is uh, standard paper types quite a bit. Advanced is not particularly too much advanced. So that's a pretty simple print driver. Okay, this is the embedded web server that's accessed by typing in the uh, IP address of the device in the uh, address bar of your web browser. And this is the uh, home page and printer status, ink level setup, uh, fax, wireless, uh, emails, shows your wireless network uh, status, uh, there's web scan, scan to computer, um, pull scan to the computer, and your address books, manage your crashing printer. <laughs> It's a it's it's a nice setup. Um, you know, scan to to uh, the web scan. Uh, it lets you pull scans to this workstation. The duplex scans as large as legal. Different resolutions. And, uh, I don't know if there's anything on the platen. Um, but it's making scanning sounds over there. Maybe, maybe if we're lucky something will show up on the um, image preview here. And oh yes, the uh, corner of the plate is showing up on the image preview. Which Beautiful, but nevertheless, if you right click it, 
you can save the picture, email it, print it, save it as a background, make an awesome background. And uh, you can save it as a JPEG or a bitmap. So that's pretty cool. This is to set up all your um, fax stuff. Uh, has a lot of fax features for people who need those things. Uh, group dial, etc. Web services. Well, we've already set set, set this up. Um, you register your device on over the control panel. Um, go to the e-printer, uh, e-print center website. Enter a code that's printed from the control panel to register the device. So it's you know we're registered. Your network settings. All kinds of stuff that you can set up on your network. Uh, tools. We've seen a lot of that. One well, interesting one is this usage report. We haven't done anything on this. We've printed a couple of pages, five altogether, black and white, two, color three. Uh, we've done 19 scans from the standard glass. Uh, it gives you, this is beautiful, look at all the information it gives you. Um, so that if you wanted to man manage this device, um, there's a lot of different ways you can do it. Email messages, center folders, faxes, um, paper sizes, media types, um, lot, lots of information there.